You waving? Oh, Hi, Bubba. Welcome to Alabama. Today we are doing something so cool and something that when people think of Alabama don't normally think of. So uh, let us show you what we're about to go do. Hey, welcome What's aboard. up? Thank you. Good evening. Thank you. Come on on. So we're stoked because this sunset time that we're heading out, we're gonna go find some dolphins here in Alabama right off the coast. Uh, welcome aboard. My name's Brian. I'll be your captain. So, really cool thing, they have these panels on this dolphin tour down here. See these windows? That's the color of the water at this point. A pretty emerald green color. The purpose of those windows, right? When the dolphins are close, chances are they're gonna swim underneath. Which I have to say, that if you're gonna observe a dolphin, this is the best way to do it. Because swimming with dolphins is dangerous. <laughs> we know that some of you guys follow the Buckleist family, because we, we've talked to us about that. Garrett and Jess have swam with dolphins. Well, and Jess loves dolphins. Jess does love dolphins. Nelly loves them too. You guys probably already heard the story, but on our honeymoon, we went and did like a dolphin encounter. And they like yelled right in your face like the screech. What's it like? It was like, I just think sometimes if you're gonna go swim with animals that live in the ocean, you should do it from a boat. Someday she'll swim with dolphins. Maybe. Maybe. Avalyn's just in the zone, guys. Did you get all? What do you see? Chances are Avalyn will fall asleep right when we get to the dolphins. Chances. How much do we bet, guys? Anytime I swear we're like, we do something epic right before like the epic thing happens, she falls asleep. Happening. Is it? Yeah, little by little. Doing it right. Thank you, Riley. You're welcome. Enjoy. It's good. Yeah. So you guys know we don't drink alcohol. But uh, so he made us an alcohol free. So what do you call that? A mocktail? Mocktail or virgin. on this boat for not very long and we've already seen a ton of dolphins which is actually pretty cool and we've also inherited a babysitter <laughs> she's adorable she i think she's falling asleep two thumbs up for dolphins down under Avalyn, it's right here it's right out there oh. look do you see it do you see the dolphin whoa <laughs> Dude, Dude, that's awesome. Here. You waving? Hi, Dolphin. Hi, Dolphin. <laughs> One of them has a, uh, looks like seagrass or seaweed hanging from it. That's like dolphin makeup. You. To the dolphin dance. Okay, team. That was awesome. That was really cool and super relaxing. It was, yeah, it was. It was, it was relaxing, relaxing, perfect. Who would have thought Alabama epic dolphin tour? So many times they were right up close, right next to us, turned on their bellies. We had those pods. I hope, I mean, by the time you see this, you've seen the drone footage. And uh, we're hiding a treasure so that you can have the same experience. Cue morning time. <laughs> what? <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, guys, it is the next day. And right across from Dolphins Down Under is this like awesome golf state park. And it has really cool wooden boardwalks that go along the sand and the beach. So duh, we're gonna go do that with our little wagon. Birds of a feather flock together. That's you and me and Davey. Hey, you and me, best friends? Okay. <laughs> Do we like the sand? 
Avi, do you hear the birds? Bird, good job, baby. Who would have thought Alabama white sand beaches? Not, me. Not you? Not me. This is where we were last night. Our boat went out in this area here. Come check out Orange Beach. If you're from the area, do it. If not, take a weekend drive. Like, make a weekend out of this with your family. How far do you think is worth driving here for a family weekend trip? Eight hours. Eight hours, easy. Eight hours one way, guys. Totally worth it. Come some weekend. Make a memory for your kids or for your loved ones, for your significant other. Out of all the states we've been to, people are always asking, what's your favorite state? This has now officially made top of my list. The top top? Yeah, I think so. Whoa. I like it here. It's just good feel. Like, you go to the California, like California beaches, it's like really touristy and honestly, it's kind of dirty and people aren't super nice. But here, it's just like calm, everybody's nice, it's clean, it's not super touristy yet, it's not super built up. There's How cold the water? Everywhere. It's not bad. Meaning, what, Avi, you want to go back to the water? And now, I'm gonna find a spot for this treasure. So we're using another small bottle. This has a Evie, what do you got? <laughs> That's awesome. Definitely come out to this beach. Take a selfie to let us know you came right in this spot. Guys, we'll see you in the next day. Bye.